Hey everybody, James Arnold Taylor here with another Jat Chat. Yes, my chance to take your questions that you've been submitting on jamesarnoldtaylor.com. You can go there and click on the Jat Show and that will take you to the link to submit your own questions if you haven't done already. But today, we are gonna spend all our time on one question. One question that has been asked by more people sending their submissions to jamesarnoldtaylor.com than any other question. And to help me out with it, uh, James, yeah, behind the camera there, can uh, you yeah, come yeah. around here? Why don't you come yeah. in and, yeah. yeah, let me just, okay, hey, hey everybody, yeah, um, yeah, okay, yeah. okay, come here, yeah. okay, yeah, so, hey, so what is this one question that we've been getting more than any? Oh, yeah, great, well, everybody wants to know, what advice can you give me, James? What can I do to become a voice actor? How can I get in? How can I break through? Yeah, great What's question. the okay. advice? All right, great, thanks, James. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you go back behind yeah. the camera, okay, okay. okay. Yes, great question. Advice. What advice do you have for somebody that wants to be a voice actor? You know, it is very hard because I get asked this question all the time. One thing you're going to find if you get into voice acting and you become successful at it, everybody wants your job and everybody thinks they can do your job and be a successful voice actor. You know, I have wanted this job since I was four years old when I first started watching cartoons. Mel Blanc, Don Messick, Dawes Butler, Paul Fries, these guys inspired me and I went, I want to do that. So I pursued this. I studied as a kid. That is the best advice I can give anybody is study voice acting. Know what voice acting truly is. If I say Frank Welker, you better know who Frank Welker is. If I say Jess Harnell, better know who that is. Uh, of course, Maurice LaMarche, uh, Rob Paulson, the list goes on and on and on. You have to know who all these people are. You've got to know what they have done because they're amazing actors. That is the key word actors. They're not just people that do funny voices. A voice actor is never somebody that just does impressions or sounds like other people or does funny voices. Yeah, that's not what it's about. It is about acting. It's about seeing a craft of storytelling that is different than anything else that you ever see in movies or on television or on the internet. It's a, it's a craft. It's a way of telling a story. That's why we all love it. It doesn't matter if you can do 50 to 100 voices. It doesn't matter if you can do two voices. If you can do one voice, great. You will succeed. If you're naturally uh, talented as a voice actor, that will happen. I started as a kid loving this stuff and going after it and listening and studying. By the time I was 16, I started stand-up comedy. By the time I was 17, I went to the local radio station and got into radio. Radio is a key component because it, it taught me how to use the microphones, the headphones, phones, all the equipment. I became a tech geek. I've built my own studios ever since then because I love all of it. You don't have to go that far, but if you love storytelling, then you can be a great voice actor. If you love being able to pick up anything and read it and make it sound as though it's brand new, but it's the first time coming out of your mouth, rather cold reading, then you've got a talent as a voice actor. If you don't, study, pick up books, get comic books, Dr. Seuss, read them out loud. That's how you learn, that's how you start forming your craft as a voice actor to be able to just read and make it sound natural and realistic. Another thing you really wanna be able to do is take care of your voice. People ask me all the time, and I'm gonna spend a, an Ask Jat all about how I care for my voice, so I'm not gonna to touch on it completely here, but I do take care of my voice. I warm my voice up in the mornings, I cool my voice off at night, I drink room temperature water. Again, I'll get into all that on another Ask Jat. Right now though, what's the advice for getting in to become a voice actor, I can't really give you one piece of advice that's gonna make it happen for you. I can tell you my story, you can read stories, you can listen to stories. Uh, other talking tunes, Rob Paulson's podcast, he's got so many great voice actors on there and they tell their stories. So study voice actors, know what they do, know what they've done, know how they've done it. Go to my website, jamesarnoldtaylor.com, click on the videos and more link, and that is gonna take you to links that I think are very helpful for people that wanna become a voice actor. Dee Bradley Baker has a wonderful site. Uh, Yuri Lowenthal and Tara Platt have a wonderful site and a wonderful book, Voice Over Voice Actor. Buy the book, read the book, study the book. If you really want to be a voice actor, you know, their book is what, uh, 10, 15 bucks. It's, it's worth the money. That's going to get you ready and in the mindset of thinking how voice actors are and who we are and what we do. You have to love the craft of voice acting. You can't just go, I want to be a voice actor because I want to make a bunch of money. I want to be a voice actor because I do a bunch of voices and I'm better than anybody else. If that's your way of thinking, you won't get very far. This is a small group of people 
people that work all the time. Why? Because they're amazing at it. So love what they do, know who they are, and study, study, study. Be patient. Be, uh, be ready for anything. Do plays in school. Study literature because reading and all of that, it's, it's essential to being a great voice actor. Watch my stage show, jamesarnoldtaylor.com. Go and see the stage show button there, talking to myself, or as it's called, Obi-Wan and Beyond when I perform it at Disney World. Learn about the craft through all of these different things. And always remember, you can ask Jat anything, anytime at jamesarnoldtaylor.com. Hey, thank you so much for taking the time to be uh, with me here on this Ask Jat. Please subscribe to the channel if you enjoy what you've been seeing watching my vlogs. But for now, saying goodbye, thank you. We'll see you next time. Okay, James, you can uh, cut the camera there. Okay, see you guys.